as long as we can increase the amount of fruitful collisions that happen in a certain time, we can increase the reaction rate. So what can you think of that might affect the rate of fruitful collisions and therefore the reaction rate? Concentration of reactants is one of these factors. What does concentration mean? It means the ratio of solute quantity per solution volume. It's measured in moles per liter and since a liter is the same thing as a decimeter cubed, a mole per liter is also a mole per decimeter cubed, which can be written mole dot dm to the power minus 3, mole per decimeter cubed. And a mole per decimeter cubed is more briefly written as m, just plain capital M, which is pronounced molar. Now, do you think that increasing the concentration of the reactants will increase reaction rate or decrease reaction rate? We could test this empirically using the setup shown here. We take iron and we add hydrochloric acid. Now, when one adds an acid to a metal, then you get hydrogen produced and also a salt solution. Aqueous refers to solution. And so we could use the amount of volume of hydrogen produced per time as an indicator of reaction rate. That's as long as we can capture that hydrogen produced. And we could do this by the downward descent displacement of water as shown in this picture. So we could answer the question, how does concentration affect reaction rate by placing equal masses of iron into the reaction vessels in each of our two treatments and then using concentrated hydrochloric acid in treatment A and dilute hydrochloric acid in treatment B. So our two treatments differ in concentration of one of the reactants, namely hydrochloric acid. We could then see how the reaction rate, which is the dependent variable in this investigation, differed between the two treatments by collecting hydrogen gas over a certain period of time, maybe over five minutes. And after five minutes, we would measure what volume of gas did we have for each of the two treatments. And we would find that in the case of the concentrated hydrochloric acid, we would collect more hydrogen gas in the same period of time than we would with dilute hydrochloric acid because concentration of reactants increases reaction rate. We can understand this because increasing the concentration of reactants increases the likelihood that they are going to collide with one another. And so it increases the likelihood that they're going to collide fruitfully because it makes it more likely that the reactants will meet at all while they're moving randomly because they're more to meet.